Oh, look at you this. You can like buy that at Walmart. Did you hear that? <laughs> yes, you can buy that at Walmart. But to him, I think he was saying that's classy. Good morning! Ah! <laughs> I almost just got the why would you do that? Sometimes that is the only way to get up and going on a Monday, especially when your Monday looks like this. You guys, hello, good morning, welcome in to the vlog today, to the week at the Bingham House. You can see the kids have on big, thick winter coats. Casey's got a big furry coat out there, guys. We're gonna go ahead and show you what we woke up to yesterday morning on Sunday, but still, it doesn't look like it's going anywhere. I can give you a hint. Okay. It's white. Okay, okay. What else? Any other hints? Let's go show them. Let's go show them. It's cold. Okay, it's cold. It's white and it's cold. Here we go. <laughs> no, guys. Good morning. This is what we're waking up to—a winter wonderland. After oh, being, I can the ice on this. I can grind it. You can grind the ice on your scooter. That's your first thought. Ice skating. It is snowy, snowy, snowy. Check out the mountains up there, covered in snow. It's official, you guys. Snow season is upon us. Come get some coats, come get some coats, here we go. It is a coat morning, for sure. Mom had to go dig out some winter coats from the basement. For school today, as you can see, the eight still hanging up there in the house. Rexy Doodle's class is celebrating his birthday, so he's taking in some donuts, some treats for the class. They're gonna share. Because it's Monday, is starting off pretty good. Some good scares, some freezing white snow, and some donuts. It's a good way to start a week. Daisy said because it snowed, she needs a Christmas mask. Oh. <laughs> We've got kind and of a Christmasy coat. And I have coat. Christmas mask. Which color would you like? Okay, those are great those, Christmas They're so hats. cute, those huh? They're adorable. from Old Navy for the little kids. You want that one? There you go. And if it need it tighter, you can just move those, okay? All right. I've got donuts, guys. Daisy, Here we go. I love you. Love you. Ooh, donuts. Ooh. Have a good day, okay? Okay. Okay, guys, stay warm. Keep your coats on. Brex, you got your donuts for your birthday? You good? And then shut that last door. Okay, all right, buddy. Kind of fun, the added element of difficulty getting out of the car in the mornings when you have to add coats to the mix, coats, backpacks, and face masks as you're completely getting dressed, getting out of the car. Going into a fun time of year now, fun season as the snow falls. Kids just asking if they can build a snowman, if they can play in the snow when they get home. So we'll see what that's like when they get home. But we do have one more surprise for you at home. So I'm gonna head home right now, show you what that surprise is. The other surprise we have for you? Let's hear it. <laughs> Mom, Mom showered and got dressed today. No, that is not the surprise. The surprise we have, Maddie slept over last night. Woo! Now, you guys, if you know, Maddie, being a San Diego teen herself, last night, there was snow. Lots of snow. Flurries and flurries of snow. The kind that you can't even see out the window. So Maddie said, you know what, rather than to brave that, I'm gonna go ahead and stay here the night. You know what that resulted in? She got a lot of laundry done. Yes, she did. And we were able to watch a scary movie last night together. It was so fun. And it was a good one. It was sightless. Yeah. Very strange, like a straight to DVD. Uh, I don't know why so no one had ever heard of it. Super crazy <laughs> twist. If you're into that stuff, it was a very compelling thriller, I would say. It was we very, very good. It. I got a yeah. lot of rest. I don't like scary movies and they never do what I want to do. Yeah, no, we don't. Now she has to go back to class, gotta go back to school. So she's waking up to see how the roads were. And honestly, the roads are fantastic. It's oh, great out there. It's I was sunny. Out on them this morning. It's not bad. Good. No problems whatsoever. But I was super grateful for that little bit of snow because that got her to sleep over last night. We got I to watch know. a fun scary movie. Yeah, that was fun. You know, it's a good warm up to driving in the snow. So Something she has literally never done in her life. So it's, it's not very fun. No, it's not. <laughs> if you're a first timer, it is not that fun. <laughs> oh, California knows how to party. California girls, they don't know how to drive in the snow because it's always hot. <laughs> Yeah, this is kind it's of the annoying. new norm for the next few months. Yeah. <laughs> Probably second guessing her decision to come to Utah right about now. Actually, kind of funny, if you've literally never scraped ice off of a windshield before, like she'd never done that. That was the first time you guys were able to experience a wind. It's her very first time having ice on her windshield. Well, so I that said was crazy. To her, I was like, is your rear defrost run? She's like, yeah. And I was like, I just didn't know if you knew what that was because living in California, when would you ever need when a rear defroster? When would you turn on a rear defroster? And she's like, I know what it is. I know. <laughs> the freezing cold Thames and the icy windshields reminded us that Rye Guy, as you recall, has grown quite a bit in the last year. We had to re outfit him with a lot of clothes. He doesn't have a winter coat that fits. He has his coat on today that he wore last year, but it's a little short on him. We need to go 
get him a new coat. And Brexton actually, I know he got his Heelys for his birthday, but he can't wear those to school. So he needs so some his new current shoes. shoes have giant holes in them. We need to go get Brexton shoes. A few things we need to get shoes, ready for coats. winter. Yeah, a little bit of winter shopping, guys. So come with us. Let's go brave the cold and do some shopping. change of plans this afternoon. We were gonna head to the mall and get Rye Guy a coat, Kruby and Breck's new shoes. Unfortunately, when they came in from school, we had like schoolwork and house stuff that needed to be done. So the kids came home, they crushed their homework. Ryler was helping crew with decimals, helping Brexton with silent letters. Brexton helped Hazy read, it was darling. So cute. We are going to forgo our mall visit. Maybe we'll try and get that done tomorrow or the next day. Ryler's coat will last a couple more weeks. We'll make sure we dial that in. Very soon, today we have the awesome opportunity of hanging out with my little nephew and their cousin, Landon. He goes to intensive therapy. A couple of times a year, he is really working hard on so many skills, really working his muscles. We get the opportunity today, we took him to therapy. We're gonna go pick him up and then take him to dinner. Something that we love doing every time he has a session at Now I Can. We're gonna head out and go do that. Just picked up Landon from Now I Can, and if you don't know what he does here, he puts in some serious hardcore workouts, but that's not enough for this guy because he's out here running laps in the parking lot. This kid's a freaking warrior. There's zero quit in this dude. So, Lando, have you worked up an appetite for a giant juicy burger yet? Yes! Okay. <laughs> he, was like, he literally was in there doing squats. He was doing hurdles, like all kinds of crazy stuff. Then he comes out here and runs circles around the car Push and out into the middle hard. of the park. <laughs> literally Please zero empty. quit. Empty parking lot. Yeah. He has agreed to go to Seven Brothers Burgers tonight, one of our favorite burger joints. I think we might be introducing it to him. Has he been there before? I don't think he's. Been I'm not there. sure if he has, but we're gonna go there, feast on some delicious burgers, pretend that it is not freezing cold outside, maybe a little taste of Hawaii. We just gotta get him to stop running laps in the parking lot, get him in the car, and we can go eat. Lando, my main man, we have arrived at Seven Brothers Burgers. Now, have you ever eaten at Seven Brothers? I haven't asked you this yet. Have you eaten at Seven Brothers before? This is your first time at Seven Brothers? We are introducing Landon to Seven <laughs> Brothers right now. This is historic, you guys. This is one of our favorite burger joints. I think you're gonna love it. Let me ask you this. Have you ever had pineapple on a burger before? No. Does that sound disgusting or like maybe kind of good? Good. Okay, well, we're gonna try that then. We're gonna get the terry for you, bro. It's so good. I think that's what it's called. I gotta ask mom for sure, but it's one of our favorite burger joints, dude. We can't wait Do to eat it. Do you think I should get the terry? I think you should, bro. It's like good, dude. It's like juicy. It's got barbecue sauce. It's, it's fantastic. It's we'll let you yet? choose. Anything you want in there, we'll let you choose. Okay. I think that's Landon's, yeah. Landon's using the restroom right now, but this is his meal. I don't think he knows what he ordered. That is a tower of a burger. You know what? He worked up an appetite big enough. Here oh, Lando. Lando, buddy, your burger's here, bro. I don't think you realize how big this thing is. How big is it? Uh, that's yours, dude. Oh. Put your head behind it. I think it's bigger than your head. That's bigger than your head, buddy. <laughs> Landon, first ever Seven Brothers experience, also ordering the biggest burger at the entire table. Might I also add, he's the furthest through it of anybody else. He has probably two bites left, Landon sized bites, in the biggest burger that they sell here at Seven Brothers. Oh, think of how hard he works. This kid burns the calories and then restores them pretty well. Maddie came here because we are in her home territory, cougar country, if you will. So Maddie came to join us for dinner, but she's got to go back study, be a college girl. Boo. Wait, what are you wearing? Wow, hold on. What do you mean? Are you downhill, Mindy? I know you're downwind. How is it up there? <laughs> <laughs> okay, love you, Maddie. <laughs> I love you guys. Okay, as luck would have it, we happen to be, the place we ate at is right next door, and I mean literally next door, to Color Me Mine, where we went and painted our pottery for Brexton's birthday celebration on his birthday, so Mindy called said, hey, fat chance, because I know it's not supposed to be done until Wednesday, but I am in the parking lot. Would you happen to have our stuff ready? Well, guess what, guys? It's ready! So we get to reveal to you what the heck our creations turned out like here at Color Me Mine. So I'm just going to pick them up right now. We're going to load them up and take them home, show you guys what they look like. Hey, 
I see the top of mine. I'm smiling, but you can't tell. <laughs> just got home, just dropped Lando off at his house, and what an incredible warrior that kid is. How much fun was that tonight with him? Guys, I was just drying the tears from my eyeballs. That kid is so strong. Motivational. Works so hard. Inspirational. You guys can see his entire <laughs> life story, his journey on our life in Holland. They've got a YouTube channel, Instagram, the whole bit, and really a lot of it is dedicated to Landon and his journey. So check that out, you guys. It was our pleasure and really our honor to be able to hang out I with him today. I can't wait to do it again. One of our favorite things we look forward to every time he is in session, is that what you would call it? Yeah, he does sessions. When he is in session, we always try and snag him for at least one of the days so we can go out to eat and witness his progress and just really be motivated by his strength and determination. And there's zero quit in that kid. Absolutely zero oh, quit. Oh my gosh. I told him that when he was in the middle of doing something today. I was like, you just never stop trying. But while we were there, while we were out to eat, we did pick up our Color Me Mine creations. We are seeing this for the first time with you here in the house. This one's Brexies. So don't, don't drop them or break them before yeah, we get to see them. Be very, very careful. Happy. Are we going to reveal at the same time or should Brexies just open his? This one feels like crazy. What if I like open dad? <gasps> I feel bad because Maddie left. She doesn't get hers, but hers is going to be beautiful. I know it's going to be beautiful. I just saw like a little piece of that fly out. Oh, Hazel! That looks so great. Hazel, what do you think? Do you love her? She's going in your room. Oh my gosh, I just saw my vase. Oh, is your vase amazing? Oh my gosh, okay. All right, guys. So let's do a little quick open. One, two, three. We'll all open together. I'll open mine last because it's not going to be that big exciting. Count to three, everybody. Open yours, but do not be crazy. Don't break them. Ready? One, two, three. Oh. Oh, mom, you're very. Oh my god. Let me see your line. Look at that, dude. Yeah, I love it. This okay. Looks like candy so That's actually okay. It's okay. It's as messy as it was when I made it. Rexon, what do you think of your car? I love it. Has your name on it. Show me the other side. You did two black wheels and two blue wheels, right? Mm -hmm. Oh I gosh, love it. That is Front so is red. I love it, dude. What do you think of it? How it turned out all shiny? Do you like it? Should we show Maddie's? Again? Yeah, let's show Maddie's because I know we won't get to show hers for Maddie, a while. Stop watching Maddie, now. Maddie, don't look. Skip ahead 45 seconds. Oh, you guys, she is such an artist. Ours are so lame. She really is. You could is buy that so in the good. store. Ours are and lame. <laughs> you would feel so good <laughs> about buying that. Hold on, mom. Look at your vase. Wow, that is like. Look at that. I mean, I'm not gonna break it. I promise. But look at you this. You can like buy that at Walmart. You take this right over here. Did you hear? <laughs> Yes, you can buy that at Walmart. But to him, I think he was saying that's classy. There you go, boom, done. We now have some new home decor. I love it. Okay, I'm not gonna mess around anymore because I'm afraid I'm gonna break it. There so you go. You know the little trick to this, Brandon? What? You put flowers in it. Looking at it straight on, that could not be more perfect. Dude. That is a Christmas gnome. I'm gonna put my coins in here. Put some coinies in there? Hazy, I love it. And Brex, do you love how yours turned out? I love how it says Brex right there. That's cool. And the red steering wheel, two of my favorites, and then the green engine. All those are my favorites. Hey, can I see the blue wheel? Try guy, dude. The geometric lion. When I did my body, I couldn't even see the paint. I was like, crap, I hope it's not like just not there. Here, but it looks no, really it's good. very thoroughly coated. And then can I tell him what happened here real quick and how you made that decision? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so he actually messed up and was painted black on this. Not just once, but, but twice. But he did it twice. <laughs> and on the second time, he was like kind of frustrated. And I was like, dude, just give him like a black goatee, goatee like right there. And it turned out awesome, dude. I That's like it. awesome. I love can it. I that we're gonna wrap this thing up that was a nice finish to the day it's been a great day overall it's been yeah, a cold been one a but really, a good one it's been a really good day it was fun to see maddie this morning wake up to her yes no hanging out with landon tonight getting and then home. maddie again <laughs> hello two maddies in one day same maddie anyways i'm getting all of our stuff from color me mine fantastic day you guys we better close this out you gotta good go monday. to the store and get me some flowers happy monday happy you guys fresh we love week. you i'm gonna get this old man to bed see you guys tomorrow good night everybody